In today's video, I'm going to be playing around with some stuff from the soft care box from Archer and Olive, as well as one of the new sticker books from Live Love Posh in my wellness planner. So stay tuned. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Or if you're new, welcome. My name is Tracy and I am a girl with plans. I want to thank you all for pressing that play button today. And if you find that you enjoyed this video, please press that like button. And if you have not yet subscribed, I hope you will consider subscribing. All right, so <clears throat> we have a lot to do today because I'm going to be trying some new things and all kinds of other fun stuff. So <clears throat> I have one of the new sticker books from Live Love Posh. This is releasing on Saturday, February the 24th. I will have my discount code as well as a link down in the description box. This is the Mystic Babe sticker book. I've already used a lot of these stickers and I literally just got it a few days ago. I have used it in my book journal and all kinds of other fun stuff. But we're gonna use this set today because you know I like to keep things colorful. And I'm also gonna use some things from here. Let's open this up. This is the Archer and Olive self-care box. I am also an affiliate for Archer and Olive. So I will have this link down in the description and my discount code will also save you 10% there. So I usually buy the mystery bundles from Archer and Olive. This is my first time buying like a full regular price box, but I had to. So this is part of the self-care box set, obviously. So oh, I almost forgot I got a writing pen in there. We have to use that today too. So I liked everything in this box and that's the reason why I got it. So I'm gonna just quickly open this. So you get a pretty pen. I have a lot of pens that I love to write with. So worst case scenario, this will be for <laughs> flat lays. I don't like how short it is, but other than that, it's fine. It's pretty, it looks fancy. Okay, and then I'm gonna quickly open this up. This are, These are playing cards, but I am intrigued by them. So those of you who have seen my other Plan With Me videos know that I do have a journal as well, a mental wellness journal. I'm using a Happy Planner Vertical currently where I can journal about my thoughts and feelings and moods. This one, they're playing cards, so you can actually use them as playing cards, but they have like little prompts on there. And I kind of feel like this would be a fun activity, especially because I haven't been the great at journaling, um, that I could just pick one. And like this says, create a gratitude page, highlight the small things that inspire gratitude in your daily life. And then you pick another random one, dedicate a spread to your favorite artistic techniques and mediums. So I feel like it could be a good way to kind of get my creative juices flowing when it comes to my mental wellness journal. So I'm actually really excited about these. Everything, this, that was one of the reasons why I bought this box is because everything I was excited about. Okay, we'll do the washi next. I'm not gonna open them up. I'm just, I mean, I might use them in the spread. I don't think they'll match, but we'll see what they are. So very, now this is gonna match the journal. So this is really pretty. It's like little gold hearts on there. And then this is some greenery, some gold and browns with some little gold flakes on there. And this is more like brown. It looks like it's like a, like a little leaf pattern. And I think this is all quotes. Yeah, so this has all different types of quotes and they're kind of in that like stamp looking type vibe where each one you can like cut it to like make them um, like little rectangles to use or whatever. All right, yeah, I'm really bad at explaining this stuff. Okay, we'll quickly show the journal. So this is an A5 journal dot grid. It says 192 pages. And of course, as always, it has 160 GSM. Now, because this is a box set, you can only get all this stuff as part of a box. They're not gonna sell it separately. You can smell the newness. So here is, it's probably gonna, oh, I thought you were gonna hear like the sound when you open up a new book. But I just love that, I mean, it really does has a, has a smell. 
like the newness smell. So here's another journal to add to my collection of journals. And I have been using so many of these so often here lately that I'm excited to actually have another one. And then the reason why I'm opening this up as part of this particular plan with me is because this stamp set I'm gonna actually use today. So let's move everything else off. Okay, so this stamp set, you get an ink pad. I actually brought a purple one there because I think I might use this instead. But you get an ink block. I mean, not an ink block, a stamp block. And then you get these stamps. Let's see, hold up. I need something. So this is like today's self-care, reflection, doodle of the day. Then you have a box, you have a battery. You know how I love my battery because <laughs> I have an icon that I create myself for the battery. And then you can kind of use this to determine like how much energy you have by doing however many bars there is. Um, and then there's some like quotes, you have your daily check-in, um, sleep quality, stress level, affirmation, hydrate, physical activity, and today I feel. I'm going to use these two today. So I'm going to go ahead and pull these out. I don't think, actually, check it. I think... Okay, so not today, but I think at the end of the week, I might use the battery to do like my overall energy level. I think that could be fun. Um, I could use one of the faces. So I can still use a stamp when I do my end of the week type reflection. So let me go ahead and pull out the pages so we can get started because we are probably like over five minutes into this video and I have not done the first sticker or setup yet, but hey, we were doing an unboxing, right? Okay. And we are going to be planning for the week of the 26th. I think I'm going to go ahead and decorate first, just so I know what I'm going, like what stickers I'm going to have left at the end. Like I said, I'm using this set from Mystic Babe. I did a full-on flip-through of this sticker book earlier in the week. I will have that video linked down in the description box just in case you're interested. Okay, so what do we want to do? What do we want to do? I think what I'm going to do <laughs> is because we're going to be just doing stamping and stuff in the wellness, I'm going to decorate this, but I think I'm going to end up speeding through some of it just because I know y'all don't want to be here all day. Um, so that's, I think, how we're going to do it. So I'm not going to run this one all the way to the bottom because the bottom actually is cut a little bit. I could also do it over here. Let's actually do this. Okay, I like that better. So my setup here is not gonna change. The only thing that is probably gonna change is gonna be my wellness because of the stamps. This sticker book, I wasn't expecting for this sticker book to be used so much since I've gotten it. Like, I absolutely love everything about it. So, <clears throat> spoiler alert, I have changed up. Actually, I guess it's not a spoiler alert. Because when I did my flip through of this, I also did a plan with me with my new reading journal. 
So I have changed out my reading journal because I want to like use more stickers, be more creative and a bullet journal kind of gives me a little bit more room to do all that stuff. So yeah, that's what I'm doing there. And I have used this book so much throughout that I'm going to be doing a full flip through of my new reading journal. <laughs> it's so funny. It's like almost the end of February and I'm already doing the new reading journal. Um, but I will be doing a full on flip through of that coming up, I think maybe on Sunday, um, if I can pull it together in time. But I have to use so many stickers from both this one and the other new sticker book that Live Love Posh released. They're releasing four, but I only have two. I had to like rein in <laughs> some of my spending. Okay. I don't think I have anything this week, but... That should still give me enough room to write everything I need to write at the top. I love these clouds. I just don't know where to put them. I could put them in my wellness section, but I kind of want to put them here. They're just so fun and whimsical. All right, I think that's good with the clouds. I just want a couple more things over here and something at the bottom. And I think we're gonna be done. I'm gonna just have to actually set up my, my journal part, I mean, my um, tracking part, and then we are really gonna be done, okay. Okay, so we did all that. So I have all the function down. I think I wanna do something a little bit different today. Beans were like doing everything a little different. I think we're gonna do something a little bit different.
I think instead of using my Apple Watch trackers here, I think what I'm gonna do is we're gonna count my steps. Let's just count my steps here. Super cute. Then I think we're gonna use highlighters up here or something, lines, maybe we'll just do lines. And that's where we're gonna keep track of my workout calories, my overall calories, burned, my stand. Yeah, that's pretty much all I really need now that I think about it. All right, let me grab a piece of paper from somewhere. Use the back of my sticker paper. Watch them all like look the same. Uh, that's not a good one. Okay. So we'll use these two. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna just do three. So all I'm gonna track this week is my workout calories, my overall calories. Wait a minute, how does that work? What do I need to track? <laughs> my workout calories, my overall calories, and my stand. I don't need to do exercise minutes, whatever. I This is more important than exercise minutes to me. Um, is like what I'm actually doing. So I'm thinking I really only need to do those because I'm doing my steps down here. So let's do it. All right, so I use this, the florals. I did remove this. Everything's coming up so much easier. Um, but I use the florals to cover this because then I started thinking, well, why don't I just do my carbs here and then I can do my stats here. You know what I'm saying? So I think that's what we're gonna do. I think I'm at, not my carbs, my macros. I always call it my carbs, but it's my macros. All right, guys, I think all I'm gonna do now is date it really quick, and then we're gonna hurry up and switch to my fitness. There we go. I feel like I could put some more stuff down here, but I don't think it needs it. Um, so I'm just gonna leave it. I use these redating stickers, which is, I feel like I've been using these. I have like four packs of them. <laughs> um, so I've been using these. These came from Hobby Lobby. This is the Paper Studio Agenda 52. They just match all of the colors I always use in this planner. Okay, so now this is done. We're gonna get to what I hope is the fun stuff. Decorating's fun, but we're gonna get to this. Okay, so for my wellness. I have ideas. I think I'm gonna pull out one more, one more of the stamps, because I have an idea, guys. I have an idea. I'm just all about having fun. Let's use the battery. And I can just write in the battery. Even though I have stickers, I really wanna use this kit. So again, this came with black, but I wanna use purple. So this has sleep quality and stress. It looks good from what I can tell. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> it kind of goes through. That's the only bad thing about Happy Planner paper. Oh, but I love this. This is so cool. All right, so I'm gonna finish stamping sleep quality for all of the other days. And I have to make sure not to put it here because a lot of times when I put my stickers, all of a sudden I just get happy with the stickers and I end up having stickers in the daily gratitude section. And then no one lets me know <laughs> until I go to fill it out. And I'm like, wait a minute. All right, y'all. Now I just started. I just started stamping, but now I'm doing the stress level ones. I don't really need the notes. I could probably hide the notes section, but that's okay. 
Maybe that'll be like an opportunity for a sticker. So obviously this has taken away my writing space. However, I can just use this. Like I've been using this for symptoms, but I can just keep it for, instead of symptoms, I can just keep it for notes. Um, and what I mean by notes is then I can put symptoms there. I can put if my allergies are starting to bother me, if allergies are high, if I went outside and did something. Like I put that kind of stuff in here too. So that way if I do have issues, I can kind of narrow it down. Okay. And then the last thing I'm going to stamp is the battery. Now, I don't know if I'm going to do this every week. Um, I do like the sleep quality and I kind of like the stress. The battery, we'll see. I might go back and forth. Y'all. It's not too bad. Okay. I got to clean all of those off. All right, so I'm liking it. <laughs> um, I'm liking, I mean, obviously it looks very cluttered. Um, I don't need the mood because I had the mood here. However, let's make it fun. And those are for my three energy levels throughout the day. I'm just going to make a comment, yes, you know, <laughs> um, that this is my first time buying, like, getting stamps from somewhere other than Amazon. And when I buy stamps from, like, Amazon or places like that, they're usually the cheaper quality. And they're fine. But these went down so much better. Maybe, maybe I was using them different. I don't know. But they just felt like they went down so much better. So. Do that. I have this feather too that I still need to use. think I'm going to label the notes slash symptoms section. I know what it is. I'll just use it for that. I don't need to put a label there. We're all good. I do love how that one's so wonky. All the other ones are pretty good. That one, I don't know what happened. All right. So I just need to do maybe this here. All right, so I think that's all we're going to do to this side. I think I'm going to go ahead and sticker up this side. I am going to use my stickers. I am going to use my weekly summary stickers. And beans, this is like turning into like a live, love, posh sticker. Let's use some of the washi tape too. So this is all the go wild washi tape, but it looks really well with the sticker set. So I think that one's going to be too thick. I'm gonna just use the ombre. Let's use that ombre. All right. So out of those on, I'm gonna go ahead and put stickers on, and I'll kind of go over these again, just in case you are new to my channel and you haven't seen this yet. So put this here because that's perfect. So the circle will go through this as practice self love. Get a massage. Buy yourself flowers. I feel like I've had that one recently. 
So these are my weekly summaries. I created my own prompts because this is the Happy Planner recovery layout and I don't use the prompts that are already on it. It doesn't pertain to the things I'm tracking. So I created my own prompts Ugh. on Cricut. I wrote them and cut them and with my Cricut. And they all pertain to what I have been tracking. I have been tracking all of this stuff now for over a year. So I probably, yeah, I started tracking it early last year. Um, and I'm pretty much tracking the same thing. So if you can't see the prompts, this is energy trends this week, weekly eating habits, weekly mood summary. Um, let's see. Sleeping patterns. I feel like we should put this somewhere. Can this go? <gasps> Weekly, um, wait, where am I at? Weekly sleep and pattern stressings. I think I did it. I don't know if I said it all. See, I get all sidetracked. Um, so yeah. And as you can see, now you know why I wanted this kit so much because sleep quality. That's the one thing that I, I do sleep patterns this week. Stress level, stress and anxiety this week. And then I do my energy, energy trends this week. So the three things, three of the five things that I track on a weekly basis I now have stamps for. Do I need the stamps? No, but they are so adorable that I had to have them. And I'm not mad about it. <laughs> it was one of those things that I was like going back and forth. I'm like, do I really need this? I'm like, but the journal is so pretty. And now that I'm like into my bullet journaling error, especially now that I'm doing like bullet journaling with my, um, well, this is very energy related. So we'll put this here. Or do I do it here? I do this one here. Um, and now I'm doing my reading journal and things like that. I feel like adding another bullet journal to my collection wasn't a bad thing either. But it was the stamps that really, I was like, I have to get it because of the stamps. Okay. Pick yourself back up. You got this. I probably do need that reminder because I have not been that good. So in all honesty, I will say, so obviously this, this video is going out on Friday. I am filming this on Wednesday. And if I'm being honest, the week prior, so last week, I did not have a good week. I started out a little nauseous on Monday and Tuesday. I think that was due to medication. So um, Monday, it was not as tolerable. Tuesday, I started getting tolerable and then it kind of lessened to the point where I'm like, oh, I can do a quick bar workout because um, I won't get my heart rate up that much and everything will be fine. Y'all, after I did my bar workout, I was like, I started getting like, my head started hurting. And I'm like, okay, that's a little strange, but whatever. All right. I feel like, I don't want to like cut this off, but it was the last thing on the sheet. Maybe I can just put it on the next sheet. Yeah, we'll just do that because I'm thinking we're pretty much done. <laughs> I, I think we're done, y'all. I mean, I don't really think there is. But anyway, so then I had, I ended up having literally the worst migraine from that headache from Wednesday through, I guess maybe Friday, um, definitely through Thursday. It was kind of like the headache hangover on Friday because it was so bad. Oh, so I did not have, I did not work out again until Sunday. So I went, I worked out one day last week. And this week I've already only worked out one day. <laughs> All right, let's pop this on the disc. 
there we go guys what do you think i loved how this turned out i think everything was super cute love these stickers oh i love this spread it's so fun it kind of is bringing me some spring vibes without being too springy i don't know i love it again all the decorative stickers came from mystic bay from love love posh this sticker book as well as three other ones go on sale saturday february the 24th at 1 p.m central standard time please consider using my affiliates link and i do have a discount code which will save you 10 percent all of that information will be down in the description box um, some of these box stickers and the step stickers are also from Live Love Posh. They're from other sticker books. Then, of course, my wellness spread, which same stickers, but I did incorporate the stamps that I got from the Archer and Olive self-care box, which is so much fun. And I really am curious to see if this is going to make filling out this on a daily basis a little bit easier. Now, I won't necessarily be leaving it blank. Um, I always felt out the sleep, but I always didn't fill out the stress levels, and I do kind of want to keep track of that. So I think this is going to be good for me. Um, we'll see if it takes up too much room, if I need more room. We'll see if I need more room. I might cut back on the stickers I put here and start utilizing this for some of the information I used to capture over here. So we'll see. We'll play it by ear. We'll, play, well, we'll do trial and error, not play it by ear. We'll, we'll do trial and error. Um, so I believe the self-care box set from Archer and Olive is still available. Um, if it is, I will have that link down below and my discount code will also work on that. So I will include that information as well down in the description box. And I would really appreciate it if you would consider shopping my affiliate links because I do earn a tiny commission. <sighs> that was a long video. Um, <laughs> I mean, hopefully I can cut it back with some editing, but I wanted to try some different things today. I thought it was kind of fun to try out the stamping, you know, and I definitely, you know, I love my fitness Apple Watch stickers, but sometimes I love not including them. So that way, you know, I know a lot of you guys don't have those stickers or, well, you don't have those because I made them myself, but you don't have, you know, you can't print stickers at home so you may not have them so I always like to sometimes throw in options without those you know customized stickers to kind of give you guys some more ideas of how you can still make it cute when tracking numbers right all right guys so that is it I hope you really enjoyed this video because I enjoyed making it and if you did please press that like button. And if you are not yet subscribed, I hope you would consider subscribing to my channel. And that is all I have for now. I hope you have a good rest of your day, evening or night. Until next time. Bye.